if you are a physicist, please take your work back all the way from the beginning. I'm talking about down to the atom and the protons, electrons, and neutrons. Take it all, instead of assuming that that's already been taken care of and that's absolute, take your work further, further back. Reconsider light, okay? Now, I'm not going to go to school for this. I don't care about that. But if you're doing that, consider what I'm saying. I'm just specifically talking to any physicist who doesn't get the whole damn universe. Because it's all one thing. But the second you start applying light, as a light, what is the word even? A light particle. I forgot. I forgot they were called particles. They don't exist. Consider that. Think if there was only atoms, but they were actually like the shell of the electron. Reconsider that. You were put in a position where you only study a certain particle, but if that particle doesn't exist, if you're not taking your work all the way back from the beginning, you, you're wasting your time. Light is just illumination. So what I'm saying is that there's no particle. And to put that in your fundamental nature as the first thing, I mean, fire comes before light. You can't have light. Okay. So I want you to take what I'm saying very seriously. You will break through a new door if you take this what I'm saying very seriously. Photons don't exist. No subparticles exist at all. You'll find that everything is a shell within shell. And that's that gravity. I mean, it'll explain everything. If you can get rid of light, if you can understand this as an illusion, you will have the complete, completed universe. I hope you take it seriously.